Hello there, I'm Elwyn, and this is a guided meditation. This is imagery through meditation, guided by myself, to help you seize mental control. Mental control is very important. We all have thoughts that cloud us and can distort our main focus throughout the day. It seems sometimes that the more we fight them or the more we try to combat them, the harder they are to get rid of. This is because they are you. It is like playing chess with yourself. You are an equal match. So instead, here is a method to help you. Feel free to use it whenever you need me. I'm right here. When you are ready, lay or sit down, be comfortable, be calm, and we will begin. I would like you to take a slow and deep inhale and a very complete exhale all the air from the very bottom of your stomach all the way up through the ribs lungs to the throat as much air as you can push out now as you are doing this i want you to begin with your awareness of that breath and once all that oxygen all that air is out of your lungs think just for a moment hold for a second no more just what comes to mind? What is there? What are you thinking about? Now breathe in. Don't try to analyze it. Don't get caught up and tangled within it. Don't try to push it away. It is irrelevant of the very nature of what comes to your mind. What is important is that it comes. Allow it to. Greet it, even. Do not get caught up with it. Regard it. And as you breathe in and out, begin to notice them as they travel across your mind. Do not hold on to them. Simply let them pass. Let them come and then let them go. For me, sometimes I like to imagine that of a fly. You know how a fly can just come into the house, buzz around and then leaves again. Something like that. Breathe deeply. In through the nose and fully exhale out the mouth. It is not important now to hold on to that breath. There is no need for discomfort. Just make sure you are breathing in deeply and exhaling just as deeply. I will begin to describe settings. Allow your mind to jump immediately to those settings. Let your mind be free to travel. Do not become attached to any one setting, anything or image place or person. You are a traveller jumping from place to place in your mind. And now we will begin. An ocean. A deep blue ocean. A beach with white sand. A seagull flying over the sand. Pelicans chasing the currents over the waves. The waves crashing on the beach. The white sand. The desert cactus in the desert. Blue sky. Blue, cloudless sky. Birds singing. A walled garden. Lush, green grass. Storm clouds. A cool breeze. A crack of thunder. 
a dark sky illuminated by lightning. A long dirt road stretching towards the horizon. A grove of olive trees. A farmer. A woman pulling water from a well. Children playing in the distance. A tall tree stretching up to the sky. Blue sky. Warm sun. Mountains in the distance. Topped with snow. A farmhouse. A stable. Horses enclosed in a coral sunset. A flock of blackbirds in the sky. The hoot of an owl, the sound of crickets, an old front porch with a swing, a glass of cool lemonade, a warm chair next to the fireplace, a grey cat curled up on a small rug, an old woman sipping tea. A rose garden in full bloom. A robin proudly displaying a worm in its beak. A hammock. Cool, dry concrete. A church with tall spires. White, puffy clouds. White dove. Burning candle. Flickering flame. Burning candle. Burning candle. Now take a deep, slow inhale. And a very long, complete exhale and open your eyes. Welcome back. These images, they will be different for everyone. That is not the point. It is not even the point what resonates to you mostly. It is the sequence of images. In many ways, you could say that this is a form of visualization in sequence to make a spell. That which calms the mind and impressions it to allow for control through the emotions that you may feel. Picture says a thousand words and a sequence of pictures in the mind from the self. Well, that's coding. Feel free to use this if it helps you. And have a blessed day. Goodbye.